X Factor judge has a temper tantrum and breaks the guitar of a contestant on stage. So it starts off pretty cordial. Sergey takes to the stage and the judges greet him. Good afternoon. Hello, what's your name? My name is Sergey. They start talking about the song that he's going to do. It's a song about love. Let's listen to the art song, Oleg. You like songs about love. So Sergey starts to play. It becomes immediately obvious that Sergey is not a professional musician in any way, shape, or form. The guitar is a bit out of tune. Vocals are definitely out of tune. But he's putting his all into it, to his credit. He's sleeping. During this performance, it's not only the judge who does the unthinkable. Actually, the way the other judges were acting, too, was very dismissive, including one who's acting like she's hurling. But for the sake of entertainment, the X Factor, people do like to see the judges reacting. So if a performance isn't great, they expect that there's going to be a little pushback from the judges. However, that's when things really take a turn for the worse. So he goes up on the stage. Sergey kind of hands it over. And he proceeds to do the unthinkable, which is smashing the guitar up on the stage. <laughs> now this is painful to watch. So he storms off the stage. I don't want to hear it anymore. Mediocre bullshit. Talks about how he doesn't want to hear any more mediocre bullshit. The other judges do not seem impressed in the least. Then he comes back and has a meltdown in front of all the contestants who are still waiting backstage. Starts talking about how he's effed up. Why the F am I sitting there? And how he'd rather watch his cats on the balcony. I'd rather be at my rehearsal. I'd rather be laying with my cat on the balcony than sitting and watching this effing stream of mediocrity I'm watching here. I mean, what do you expect? It's a talent show for crying out loud. So this judge didn't even have a clue about the backstory of this guitar. Not to mention that he shouldn't have done it anyways. But then you think about it, this is a guitar that was given to him by his father, who had actually passed away, and he took it and smashed it on stage for him. So backstage, after the end of the show, this judge gets on his knees. If you want, I will get down on my knees. Please, sing for your children. He's begging people not to be mediocre, and finally walks off. F. Story has it that at the end of all this, he ended up getting canned, rightly so. I mean, I've known Simon Cowell to be a crybaby, but nothing to that level. When I used to watch American Idol, I mean, I loved the fact that Simon Cowell would give it to it straight to a lot of the people who are very delusional about their singing skills. But yeah, this is going to go down in history as one of the biggest flops. And you know, sometimes people feel like they're being a hero in one way, shape, or form. What happened here can actually really be likened to what happened when Will Smith went up and slapped Chris Rock. Will Smith thought that he was being a hero. You can see the way he strutted off the stage after he was done doing what he was doing, not realizing that he was kissing his career goodbye, which is what happened with this judge. This judge thought that he would make a real statement by going up and smashing this guy's guitar when in fact, he just looked like a complete and total douchebag. So the moral of the story is, no matter how important you may think you are, do not go smashing people's guitars up, because it could definitely ruin your career. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Word needs to get out.